Er immer noch Nacht, trotz Verlichter er fuhrt wieder klar und das Band ist durch lange noch Richard Moss, The Enclave. Agus ohne Malali er kein Schlemmeri oder Doyle Kennedy. If ever you go and head to the Thorn deal him Verlichter gaz around around ich lag nicht schäme one city one book if ever Schuler fuhrt wieder klar in mir Brown. If ever you go to Dublin town in a hundred years or so. Inquire for me in Bayard Street and what he was like to know. Oh, he was a queer one, followed all the Dido. He was a queer one, I tell you. My great grandmother knew him well. He asked her to come and call on him in his flat, and she giggled at the thought of a young girl's lovely fall. Oh, he was dangerous, followed all the Dido. He was dangerous, I tell you. Wie ich schon gehört habe, tief, tief, tief und genau, dass dass Fekem Jalav Kavna aus aus dem Chor macht, wird nach Chor Law. Dass es mir nicht ich auch nicht erinnern erinnern an schon. If ever you go um, to Dublin Town, you know, inquire for me, inquire for me in 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 Bacchus Street. Dass man schon das ist nicht like Tani und Gamor um, und und Tetra Thor er erinnern mal auch an schon. If ever you go, es mir nicht mehr Heifsche Kavna Schachter Ash kann nach Chor. So es mal um like es mir nicht erinnert Heifsche Galer at all hart. Gachoich. <laughs> <laughs> So Larna Blina is Rod Umlon Eg Sula Toranhem Lena Agus um is Knusak Filichta I will say her on Estana Eg Sula and uh Fos a Ling Agus Nakmarin Aka will don Kamaha a Kofi while you are clear. Madly singing in the city. After Po Chu E. And often, when I have finished a new poem, I climb to the dark roof garden and lean on a rail over an ocean of streets. What news I have for the sleeping citizens and these restless ones still shouting their tune in the small hours. Fumes rise from the chip shop, and I am back at the counter waiting my turn. Cod Haddock Place, Whiting. The long queue moves closer. Men in white coats paint fish with batter. Chips leap in the drying tray. There's a table reserved for salt and vinegar, where the hot package is unswaddled, salted, drenched, wrapped again, and borne out into the darkness. I stand in the dark roof garden, my lungs swelling with the new poem, my eyes filled with buildings and people. I let them fill. Then, without saying a word. I go back down. Charmin is Nifola. In Moor Street, where I did dwell, a butcher's boy I loved right well. Moo, ooh, a chanamush, shakus, mew, ew. Vich blas, a gandarnan, a varga hartest. Na ew, ewers, bahukusi, grad hello. In Moor Street, where I did dwell, a butcher's boy I loved right well. Tinker, Thalor, Bushter, Bakker, Muntor, Sidor, Nushan, Shuner, Bushter, Kayor, Susi, Fend and Bushter. And Ram Kane of Yoker Gaffin, a Jeh, who's Harrington Street, a Hoggerty Shisha Chukadorok, the Camden Street, a Budina Eleid, who's in San Aglish, Swedish base up, August Mean, August Monla, you know, and Hot of Felt Heaserin. Give me a nice tender little bit, please, Billy. It's been with town toss of a shop on Vushtera. Over in Gar Shulfio, Marganahanin far na fola deal, dan na fola chanoch, is a valer tart. Kurtzer, 
Een derde genoeg er een show. Bij moet ik veel schappen. Ik crew. Lean, lap, billy, love, belly, bacon. Low, in die glee, gach, low, daar sail. Amen. Harter Kwege Makti or Shul La Haik um one city one book a Kirk and Keen Nagasanoira Bay Ram Shak as Kuak Nafiliakta Flay Ignal McMonagan Salarla Navalia Clea Agas uh Bay Trust Thora Hair Eraher Nakahrock Bay uh Cruiser in Liffa Agas um on Grieve Mokt no Kellora Baha Baha Agase her Yemusi Haini so Liling me Avro in Bay on Kahir Bio Biahok La Filiakta Emilia, la hay un city one book. From my hometown, my memories are fresh. From my hometown, Liffey Swim. In the dream, the Blessington Street Basin fills with the Liffey's stout bottled waters, but still the swimmers come in droves on the stray sovereign of an Irish summer's day. The river courses through the city turning roadways to canal banks that shrug their shoulders into dark water. A man rises, seal-like in his call of silt to wave. At the sluice gate, where the river bends out of sight between toppling buildings, a black dog jumps again and again into water. And there, at the edge of vision, my parents, ready to join the swimmers, gesture their cheerful farewells. Am stand dealem sinner foil a shippy lower, a gazel lower than a pipe leave la clea. Will Hahn Green Raffadort, a gascon on or Richard Moss as Kilhunig, three blina attached to Hig Public, Rain Lahach and Hango, tear to a saute equivalent, a gazbrecious cooig villain dinner in Ig Bossoil. Rownia ha hair let us point, Ig be an ally in a Venetia in Eric, a gazlarsh ned nevoenig, la Richard Moss, Mariella and Sayher Sitalasa, the enclave. Congratulations, Richard Moss. You represented Ireland in the Venice Biennale. Can you explain to me where you got the title, the Enclave from? All of the work here, the photos and the film inside, are, was all shot in different rebel enclaves around Eastern Congo, and there are many. So you have at least 20 different rebel groups. And they're essentially, they're operating in a place that really has no law and order. I decided to call it the Enclave, to really to conflate this, these different rebel groups into one sort of almost mythic rebel group. So one destination to be going. It's, it's really about this journey through the jungle, across the front lines to this very remote, isolated enclave. Really to cross a threshold from civilization into a place where justice doesn't prevail. This was once a primeval jungle, um, and that the indigenous Congolese tribes lived in it, living off that jungle, eating bush meat and planting crops. But the Tutsis moved in, took the land off, they literally took it by force off the local people. They then chopped down all those pr the primeval jungle, all those really beautiful old rainforest trees, and they stripped the land and, and made it into pasture land for their cows. I began to realize over the years I was working in the Congo that although it's difficult to see the trace of the conflict, it's not impossible. You just have to know how to read it. You have to know how to read land use and how, how the land is exploited. This valley itself is, is the site of human rights violations on an on a ongoing um, basis, but you can't really see that there in the landscape. Documentary photography, that it's very literal and it's very, you know, it, it doesn't really, it's not very complicated insofar as it, it can't really represent the intangible or the abstract or, or very deeply complicated situations. And conflict is essentially complicated. So I was interested in, in That's really... the power of the work, in my opinion. Great. That you can't. And I am more curious now. And I, you know, you forget the, the figures, if you like. Since 1998, like, people have been murdered, basically. 5.4 million, isn't it? 
And we don't hear about this anymore in Ireland, I feel. You know, the world news, I'm sure, carries Absolutely. stories, but it's not that many. Not on the tip of my tongue. And no. I was really surprised because it's in our lifetime, if you like, it's, it's living, mm. it's happening. And what attracted you to the Congo? Well, I, in all my practice, uh, since I've begun making art, I've always made art about, about conflict spots and post-war zones. And, and so that's just really my zone as an artist. Each artist has their focus and their interest and, and what gets them thinking. I, I have to say, I grew up in a nice, peaceful part of Ireland, but traveling across the border as a young lad and hearing about the problems up north in the 80s, um, indirectly, I think all my work relates to that sideways uh, <laughs> in some way. I've been on eight trips since I started. I started in 2010, January 2010. In any case, after about two years, I had my first exhibition and I published my first book. And, and normally you're meant to stop there. <laughs> but I realized this is just the tip of the iceberg. This project has a lot more steam in it. And what it really needs is, is, a, is a, a moving image piece, something like that. And I came across the film, the same film that makes these peculiar colors, uh, but it was in 16 millimeter format, old school, you know. There's only maybe 40 reels and stuff left in the world, and I got my hands on that. Quite a special lucky break that I had to, to procure the stuff at all. So tell me about this as an installation, all the screens. Yeah, so there are six screens, and they're, each of them are double-sided screens, so you can see them from both sides. So in a, and they're all in one large darkened chamber. And so you could be watching one screen here and then that goes off. And then you realize there's a screen behind you is playing. And you have to, sometimes you have to go through this screen to see the screen over there. So really the viewer is activated within the space. And, and that's important too, because we want people to realize that there are many different positions you can view this conflict from, not just the one. And it's important that the viewer, you know, takes his own position rather than the film tell him what to think. And I've, I've left it very open-ended in that respect. It doesn't have the same sort of narrative uh, beginning, middle and end. It's a looping piece and it's as non-didactic as possible. Uh, it makes you do the work. You have to understand we were running with a Steadicam here. That's why it's sort of floating along. It's very difficult working with such a heavy apparatus in such a, such a difficult environment. You can see it's a lot of kids running around. You can't really plan it. These children look like, uh, or are, are reacting almost as though you're playing with them. Yeah, well, they're, they're, they're great. Chasing game. Congolese kids are great. And this is a very miserable place. It's a lot of illness, a lot of people coughing. That's, that baby's quite sick. This camp here was, uh, there's about 60,000 people living. It's called, a place called Canyon Rochinia, north of Goma. And the front line literally swept right, right up to it. Um, and the fighting also. And so the, the people who lived there just fled. And they had about 20 minutes to flee. And they, they don't have much, but they had to pack it all up in 20 minutes. Richard, do you feel your work is highlighting what is going on in the Congo or do you feel it's even making a difference or a contribution or anything? Like it's such a small drop in this large ocean, if you like. You know, I used to, I used to, I used to say, you know, I was trying to raise awareness and in the early days of the project and, you know, that was what I was trying to do, but I, I didn't actually believe I was. <laughs> but now I think I think it has had a small trickle-down effect in the mass media. You know, the work has, has trickled into the BBC News website. It's been published in the New York Times. And, you know, it's, it's gotten that sort of momentum behind it that the main mass media and the news media as well have actually recognised it um, as news, even though it's an art project. So it's, it's a very unusual place to be situated as an artist. But if the colours are shocking enough and aggressive enough and original enough as well. If people haven't seen that type of imagery ever before, they stop and they're like, they have a moment. And if you can hit them then, this is Congo. You know, if that, if that can keep moving around the world on, on the internet virally, that's great.
agus beg deshig mwinter limni e eishkint un tachtan sechu in eraig in Ormston House. Aroni Ashdor agus Commodore Ildonach i Maria Doyle Kennedy a vogan ogaun alina avon gadan ele gan stroer be banavina shirch luishacht ider remshi ile na krocha hochte be kernin urda ke de tachtemach amorch Maria live agus larshi le huna melali Maria mila buik as asacht larchlen in you um nor swinging to earn an maid ibrato danta agat um harna blint agus fasnish to she says to khreta Nervin to attach on down because like Shannon Giggs looks like to have the scan on a television or payload and will say darker on sports and crohy of the all um con con an alini yen of um you know the inch and vein. To actually to well to she dumps and he'll say you could darker like here on being she goni just of spade less tus no payout will say or train. Oitre be ox being a guitar again, ox just tossing jay shined up. Um, talking to you on them so ox me fade alum, the radical air, a yen of a gnam cane, a chime ve sort of dear a hair, hyan a wine, a gama wine. Toshi dacker, ox tomid gnohoch, mon will mid, you know, touring or ain't what Martha posture going so ton, you know, ton talk, gnohoch, a time galair, but does she okay? I was in the middle of the day. I was in the middle of the day. I think we on on sort of Horla Rodagan Nua doing sort of Leveil Bjog Nua um, le sing, Leshen Kernin sing. I was in the middle of the day. 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 Ek shined, ek tashtel, and then of gigs uh, just in Bertigwing, and vidini ro agoni, ta and mate and Erin Kearney, ta share sing, ach ta Tarlene ro different live, agus just in Bertigwing, gan enia ella, gan en, um, you know, gan overdubs, gan en with agus coalition, and so just we found her in a yenev, so just ta she really um picture is the closest. To another of him or a shine to fire a rovely in Chicata, so she didn't fall. Weren't there been been any scannery here if we really did eggs, Julian, of a such the run no kaime of a in a Aling Tor Marshin, no kaime of a vashing of a shin a. Yeah. On guy would on dark a shin a ahru. Arian to Roddy Agoni mar um sampli a horto, I think, on rich a horla dumsa, you know. I mean, on ten or the kai to follow him really, con ve a crovainrod is gone ve burra um er kadvi rol a inyala. So, magyakn tu ko will tu inan rod a ganella a yen of den dene. Ach, ni feder lat, I think ni feder is shin avuna, you know. Kai tu just a shin, I think, a oil on a ten, just gone ve burra, fui fak ach, kato rog a ten, was kato to yen of a crov. Agus an shin, 
you know, leave out the birth of Henrod. Then it will learn ready, no red wine, August just by Kerkel or by two, just the go a hen oil, August uh, eerie. Alin Thor Alan Spirit Alan Thomas Temple Anisha Emma and Patrick Scott Anish them fui um the Kangala la Pat the Vumelash um I suppose for her quick playing of him better August just I mean then I go um special the of the um the ref she really the ref she gary really advice a hurt you know the the vein mass we get really our advice you know we she are not go Guy to the Schleihen a oil, August a lagemach. Ach, we should force um, a goni encouraging, you know, nor we may just orient a big on in um, or it's just a giri ruddy a scrive bader, August never near a shed tart. August, you know, dear me, or you know, God, the enemy, you know, God, the end, God, in too, you know, and he'd say, Oh, Maria, just, just make it. That's all, just make the work. There were his words. He was just really, really, then I on a special day. I guess I thought I'd talk to you about it. I mean, I should have a lot of money. Well, um, Tom Kearney knew a, a talk to Mark on live um, album, so I think Tom had to go to the gig. I guess I'm Kearney and Phil Lorca talk to Mark. I guess uh, Kurpaksanam, that Kurpaksanam, I talked to Mark as yeah. well. Vinamay Shin had fun. We shouldn't just really eat it. Anish tham fui na iron swoon. Tosh ek hume fui pas Scott. We should go ni ek ek tarin tini lekhela kun bia a vel kul lekhela. We should shin an an a tough tuch do breaking bread with people. Somehow we should just. You know, so just feel me sweet version. He carries his love and jam jars. You were about to meet him soon. If he offers a sip to your stony lips, you'll probably swoon. Because his love is like a little piece of the moon. Brings his love and carry your baskets. He might leave one at your door. While you're wondering what you did to deserve it, you'll probably swoon. Because his love is like a little piece of the moon. His love is like his love is like his love is like a little piece of. Shows his love and sustenance. He might whisper as you sleep. I'm afraid that you'll probably forget him. He'll gently mock your weeping. Because his love is like. 
a little piece of the moon. His love is light. His love is light. His love is light. A little piece of the moon. Bigger down to reach the Tacht and Shahu in Rivet Clor Special to Gun, Tacht Hoof, or Hyantern Nation, Agashinabula, Lahalian Torin Duichison.